My day doesn't wake up with an alarm that's all making horrible sounds. My alarm sounds with classical music. The first thing I do after uh, giving thanks, after I give thanks, then what I do is I do my breathing. I also talked about that in my very first video. Hi, welcome to my channel. My name is Frank Kinigas. I am the ambassador of reading and today's topic is amazing. It's about the first 10 minutes of your day and the last 10 minutes of your day. And I'm gonna tell you why they are so super important. I'm gonna tell you how I do it and I know a lot of people do similar stuff with what I do. The first 10 minutes of my day. My day doesn't wake up with an alarm that's all making horrible sounds. My alarm sounds with classical music and I'm not, and what I do when I wake up, I have trained my finger not to have a brain of its own where it goes and snooze, snooze, snooze. I wake up and I get started and it's a soothing day. When I get up, the first thing I do after uh, giving thanks, I know that I talked about gratitude in one of my other videos, go check it out. After I give thanks, then what I do is I do my breathing. I also talked about that in my very first video about uh, things that give you more life, uh, the, the important things about life or something like that. Go check it out. I do my breathing. I talk about four seconds, taking a deep breath, holding it for 16 seconds and releasing in eight seconds. I do that for about three or four times. After I do that, I go down to the bottom of my house, to the first floor of my house. I go to my kitchen and I get my water. <clears throat> I put a little bit of lemon. You don't have to do that. It's up to you if you want to. I used to start my day with coffee. Crazy. It, it, the coffee dehydrates. So now I hydrate my body. It's been going on for years now. And I slowly drink my water. I go back and I get my clothing ready. I take out my planner and I review. <clears throat> I review what I need to do. Many times I have to answer comments. Thank you for uh, sending me your comments. Uh, many times I need to make phone calls or visit people. And at this time, I like to say thank you to the many people that have uh, sent comments from around the world. I have people from Spain, Ecuador, Argentina, Brazil, Mexico, Honduras, Nicaragua, El Salvador. I have some people from the states like New York, New Jersey, uh, Florida, Nevada, and a few others. Those are the uh, few names that I was able to remember before I got started. And I know there were people that uh, pretty much sent me a personal comment. Thank you. Thank you for the information and all that. Anyway, after I give thanks, I get ready. I look at my planner. My day is going to be a nice day because I'm starting it by giving oxygen to my brain. I'm, I'm starting with hydrating my body. And like I told you, drinking water activates the eight general systems, which is great. Now my day is going to get started in a good way. Many people, what they do is they don't even, uh, they're not even aware that their finger is doing the thinking for them. Snooze, snooze, snooze. And what happens, they run late. They're going to have a hard time trying to catch up with everything they have to do. They show up late, their heart's beating hard, fast, I'm sorry, and, and their day's gonna be thrown off. Now, after a long day, what many people don't do is they, they don't relax the body. It's, um, <clears throat> you have to relax it. You have to, I go, when my last 10 minutes of the day are coming, I do everything in reverse, except that I go to the kitchen first, get my water, and instead of drinking it all in one shot, I'm, I'm looking at my planner, make sure that I got the things done that I wanted to get, like recording for today and any of the other things that I need to do. I review my agenda, and if I have to, I make a little note. What I didn't get done, I'll get done later on during the week or maybe the following day. I go up to my bedroom. I set up my clothing for the next day. I, I relax. Uh, I put on, I don't know if you have an Alexa. I have an Alexa, and I set it up either for... Uh, classical music or forest sounds which have no words in it it's very relaxing because I can tell it when to stop I usually go for 20 no more than 30 minutes I do my breathing my wife and I sometimes do the breathing together we're laying down and we're talking about our, our what we did during our day we'll do our breathing we're giving oxygen to our brain we've already hydrated our body it, our body's going to do what it's supposed to do which is clean itself so we have an advantage for doing that. The first 10 minutes of the day, the last 10 minutes of the day, we make sure no TV, no news. Definitely don't put any news in your, in your head. A lot of horrible news sometimes. So you're going to be all jittery. Don't do that. Relax your body. Thank your body. Relax your brain. Relax everything. Give it oxygen. Give it water. My wife and I usually, we talk about our day. We lay down. We do our breathing. 
kiss each other good night, and that's the end of our last 10 minutes. Now, many people have asked me, do you drink coffee, Frank? And I tell them, yes, I do drink coffee. However, I put in, I hydrate my body first, make sure that the body, that the water does <clears throat> what it's supposed to do for my body, activate my general system, hydrate it, make sure that I'm going to have the energy to go. Then after 15, 30 minutes, I'll go and set up a nice pot of coffee and I'll drink my coffee and I'll either uh, read a book on whatever I'm interested in or review my agenda and then take it from there. I do drink coffee. Now, people say, do you always do this? Uh, they've asked me, do you always do this? No, I don't always do this. Many times when my wife and I are traveling, either doing the seminars or taking vacation, we don't do it. However, for the most part, this is how our, our, our day looks. First 10 minutes, this is what happens. Last 10 minutes, that's what happens. I highly recommend it to you because it's going to be of service. It's going to be something that's going to benefit you. A lot of people, they really uh, push their bodies too much. They don't compensate them. They don't give them enough water. They don't give them any oxygen. They get tired. They're always tired. They don't even know why, they, why they're tired. Many people sleep uh, 8, 10, 12 hours and they still feel tired. Why? Because they're not hydrating their body and they're not putting oxygen in their, in their brain. So there you go, the first 10 minutes and the last 10 minutes of your day. Uh, I'm gonna call it a wrap for that. I wish you well till next time. Your friend, the ambassador of reading, Frank Kinigas, wishing you well today and always, knowing that you will find and get what you are looking for.